Good afternoon, everyone. This is Abby Bliss White, and I am checking in on you um, about my Augustinus Botter two week challenge. So here's the deal forgive me, for I have sinned. <laughs> yeah, this beauty junkie cannot live with just this product. Um, I have cheated just a little bit in this two week challenge. I was finding that my skin, um, I think I've mentioned this a couple different times, you guys, but my skin was feeling very dry with this product and I have the rich cream. Um, so I did a couple little things, um, because I was going to keep to this two week challenge of just cleansing my skin and then using two pumps twice a day. Um, but I really was finding I was having a lot of tightness in my skin. I gave it a full eight days. Um, and now I do have to say I was missing a few of my products. So I'm gonna tell you what I did add in, but I am still using this cream and I have one little trick um, that might help as well. Um, but ultimately already, I'm just gonna tell you that this cream, not that I think it is, um, I think it is improving my skin tone um, and I'll give you a close up in a minute. I just don't know if it is going to replace my serums, my eye cream, and I'm definitely not finding it very moisturizing. And again, for your reference, if you're new to my channel, my name is Abby Bliss White. <laughs> I am 50 years old. I have little moody, I don't really like to call it sensitive skin, but I kind of do, um, meaning that I will have some rosacea outbursts, and generally that has more to do with my diet versus, it does have to do with playing around with products as well. Um, but I will say, um, you know, this is where I'm at, so I have normal to dry skin, and I would say I guess I definitely have dry skin after this experience. Um, definitely was not feeling hydrated. So what I did do and what it has reinforced for me, and I'm gonna ask you guys um, in a bit if you want me to do a different video on this, but I really miss my um, P Lotion P50. This is Biologique. Rusher, share, <laughs> butchering that. I just know this is lotion P50, and you guys, I alternate. Um, this is something that I absolutely swear by, um, but I have lotion P50 1970. This is the original um, exfoliator, and I absolutely uh, love this one. I also have just lotion P50. This is the one without the phenol in it. Um, and I started out with this guy and then moved on to, let's see if we can get it, there we go, to focus, moved on to um, lotion P50. You guys, these are my travel size. And then I have now been using Lotion P50, the PIGM 400. This is for hyperpigmentation. Um, and I am a huge fan. So a couple things once my skin was sort of dry previously, I was using the um, Is Clinical Complex um, Cleansing Complex. And that one, I was feeling like my skin, that didn't make my skin feel dry, but since this product was making my skin feel sort of dry and not hydrated, I switched cleansers. And I swear by this uh, late VIP O2 cleanser by, um, I just call it BR, <laughs> Biologique Resher. <laughs> I don't know how to say it, you guys. I'm gonna give you a close up so you can read it. Um, Resher, something like that. Anyways, this is just a really super great milky cleanser. Um, and this just does not strip my skin. Oh, I'm gonna be sad if I'm almost out. So this is just, I've switched to a milky cleanser um, and this was helping tremendously. But since my skin was feeling dry and flaky, I did feel like I needed to exfoliate. So I have added in 
um, my lotion P50, and again, I kind of vary it. I will do this in the morning with the PIGM 400, and I will do um, lotion P50, either 1970 or 19, or just lotion P50 at nighttime. And again, I alternate every other night. I don't use this um, every single night. Uh, so, but I have, I did cheat people. I cheated. <laughs> I also did add in a facial oil. So what I have been doing is I have cleansed, then I have toned, um, and then I will be adding on the two pumps of the Augustinus Butter Rich Cream. And then if I am still feeling dry, I have been adding in a face oil. I've been using Drunk Elephant um, Virgin Marula Oil. And, oh gosh, I have a whole bunch of oils. Um, there was one other one that I was using. Um, oh, I had the Vintner's Daughter. Um, that oil is super active though. So anyways, I have been adding a little bit of more moisture to the, um, to this challenge. So I have cheated. <laughs> I am not at this point completely sold, um, on this cream and I'm going to give you a close up now. So I do have to say, I think that I was trying to do less is more and I do think that my skin has improved in tone um, by using this cream. Um, but it is just, I think my main thing is I need more moisture. I, do, I don't feel like it is giving me enough of that and I just know that that's an important component for someone of my age. Um, but anyways, um, I guess I would tell you I do feel like it is clearing up, giving me better texture and tone with my skin before starting the challenge. Um, I would had a little bit of an outburst by using a foundation that really upset my skin, so I was having um, a little bit more um, of some bumps and a little bit more texture than I normally do. So I do feel like it is improved on that. I think what I would say for those of you that are interested and think, you know, they claim that this is going to replace your serums, your moisturizer, eye cream. And I think if you're a fellow junkie like myself, I don't think that's going to be the case. <laughs> um, now one trick I wanted to give you. This does say that you need to take the two pumps and then rub it between your fingers to kind of activate it. And I think what I was doing is I was applying it just straight on dry skin without activating it. And when I started doing that, I felt like it did break down something in it and that my skin has been feeling better. And I started doing that for the last two days. And I do have to say, I think that that has helped tremendously. So if you are using this and feeling a little bit dry, make sure to take an extra minute or two and really rub it between your hands, kind of like the La Mer. If you've ever used Creme de La Mer, um, you need to, you've got to warm it up and almost make it translucent before you press it on your skin um, in order for it to kind of break down and um, activate whatever it is. The <laughs> Whatever that, you know, I always thought I know La Mer has some naughties like petroleum and mineral oil, but for some reason it does tend to work. Um, so it, anyways, you do need to, I have found by doing that, it did seem to work a little bit better. So I am going to continue on using this little guy, but did want to give you an update and did let you, I do feel like my skin has been missing the exfoliating. It was feeling dry. It was feeling flaky. And maybe it's because I've been using this and I do call this like almost like the jungle gym for my skin. <laughs> I, I really do feel like um, if you guys have not used this number one, um, this lotion P50, I think it is worth every little penny. Um, it stinks. It does not smell good. The first time I used it, my skin blew up like a tomato. Like I literally thought I burned my skin. Um, and <laughs> I, 
I was so worried. I was like, oh my God, what have I done to myself now? Because it was completely like tomato red. Um, and then though, when I woke up in the morning, my skin just was so baby soft, smooth. Um, I just cannot, I guess I was just saying, you know what, my skin is used to using this. So I'm adding this little element back in and maybe I'm not cheating. You know what? Maybe if it was saying mm, serum and moisturizer, <laughs> um, all I've done is add in a little toner. So maybe I haven't cheated, but I really was feeling like I needed that for my skin. And you know what I might do? And you guys can let me know. I will give you um, kind of a little bit of my routine and products that I use from this line. Um, you guys let me know down in the comments if you would like something like that because I am a huge fan of that and there is a toner for every skin type and I have tried I almost think I might have tried all of them all of the different ones but anyways there's different variations and I can tell you a little bit about them um on that note I am going to be going to rescue spa in New York when I go for Thanksgiving to see my son um and I will take you along for that special facial um and they do an analysis of your skin from the biologique um line so Anyways, I am going off on a tangent now, but wanted to give you a little update and I will be back. I'm gonna complete, I have got four more days. Actually, no, I've got about five more days on this challenge. Um, and then I will give you my final kind of thoughts and results of using this. But um, yes, I did a little cheating. Okay guys, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and I love hearing comments from you. Um, and anyways, thank you so much for everything and I will talk to you later. Bye.